Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Matt J Play some more PGA Tour 2K23. It's been a minute since I've dropped the video, but we're back, baby. We're gonna play another new course this week from my man Alan WE54 called Aggo Adolce. Full disclosure, he released this course a couple of weeks ago. It's his entry into the TGC Tours a major competition. I just haven't had a chance to get on and give it a go. So we're gonna give it a whirl. Well, let's have a look at the course details. It is a par 71. It is four pins. It has black and white tees. The white tees play in 7,459 yards. It's at 2.7 thousand votes. And it's cold in at four stars. So let's give it the whopping five. Not even played it yet, but I love Alan. And it'd be good to get that up there. We are going to play from the longer white tees. We're going to play pin set one as always. And we're going to keep everything as the designer inten intended in terms of the settings. They pick the way that you want the course to play best. So that's what we'll do. As I said, guys, this is Alan's entry into TGC Tours major design competition where people are designing the course to host the major on TGC Tours. And for these unusually brutal courses, you would have seen me play through a few of them. Uh, previously and they are absolutely horrific um i've not done well i've done well on some not on others alan has challenged me to get double digits under par so hopefully we can if this ever loads Hello and, welcome. and here we are on the first tee guys after about a six week wait on the loading screen we are here and we have a 472 yard opening par four that's a long old par four beautiful little oxbow lake over there so let's try and hit this down the middle of the fairway my first drive of the day leaking out to the left a little but should kick up and run all the way back down as you'll see on these courses guys major design courses the fairways are undulating the greens there's elevation changes there's horrible pin positions look at this it all runs right you catch us in the wrong place you are foobard um i don't know how you catch us in the right place though given the way it all just runs off and leaks off down there tough pin alan tough pin dirty pin on this first hole my friend um do i hit the 170 <sighs> i'm gonna hit the 180 for a little bit of loft a little bit of spin don't need much loft and spin actually. I'm on a steep slope. So hopefully I can land this and stick it on the only flat bit of the green. That's gotta stop. That's gotta stop. This could be a great shot if it stops. If this keeps rolling, no, I'm in trouble. Oh no. <laughs> no please stop. Ooh. Nice shot. That'll, that'll do. That is a lovely, and this is a thing with these courses, guys. If you want to drop this um, in hole. I'm probably going to get angry um, because they are frustrating as hell, as you can see. That was a lovely shot in and just kept getting worse and worse and worse. But we have a 20 foot putt at it, 142 green speeds, and look how fast these are moving, guys. Imagine if they put, if Alan put this on a fast, if TGC Tours puts this on a fast, you ain't putting this green. So. It's going to be interesting to see how these courses work in TGC Tours. I think people are going to pull their hair out. That was a terrible first part. Didn't turn as I expected. But we're in with par. And you know what? My first hole of the day, my first swings of the day. I'll take that. Could have been a lot worse. Full disclosure, guys, as well. I did actually play this course um, upon release when I tried to film my first video for it. Um, so this isn't my first playthrough, but that was on my old pad and i was getting so much lag you remember my old controller that i used to love and praise then it just started massively malfunctioning had lag issues couldn't swing the club couldn't do anything so i had to quit out and stop the recording um so this isn't the first time i'm seeing this course but it should be my first recorded playthrough um with a decent controller so let's go it's a tough bar three to start 230 yards. I need to kick right somehow. It's going to kick left. <laughs> tough opener, but nice I've got two putts in the first two holes. Right. I'm going to take that. To These go. are tough opening two holes. A nearly 500 yard par four and a 230 yard par three. Um, and the reason you'll see this, guys, is in TGC Tours, a lot of the top players play the powerhouse um, attribute. So 
they all can reach these with probably irons. Oh, what a putt. That is a glorious start. I'm going to need more of them today. So they have um, way longer clubs than me. My club setup isn't really designed for these major courses. I've noticed the recent reach is not really designed for platinum. So I'm probably going to have a club rethink at some point in terms of what's in my bag and how I want to play the game moving forward because I can't compete right now with the gaps and the yardage I have with the clubs I have because the 3-iron obviously kicks on. Um, oh. This bunker isn't a bad shout, to be honest. I think even if you play over here, the whole green is running away from you. I can't hit the 230 because I'll be just off the back. That ain't stopping. <sighs> I'm going to have to bail into this bunker. I can't see another way around it. That's annoying. This club goes to 222 um, when I've got all my stats kicked in. But zero wind at the minute on this course, which is interesting. I'm sure my first playthrough was around 8 to 10 miles per hour. So default wind may be a bit sporadic. You know what? I'm going to deal off this a little bit. This is risky, guys. This could be in the water. But let's aim on the right-hand side. Oh, I've chunked that. I have chunked that. I need that to go. This could be all right, though. Kick up now. Kick. That's not bad. That's, that was an absolute shit show of a shot, and it's worked out. I mean, I don't know how I hold the green here from the rough. Um, so Alan did say you need to pick your landing spots, but if you can't swing properly, it doesn't matter what you pick. And somehow, I even got to dunk this. Oh, no. Stop. Stop. All right, I'll take that. I'll take that. Nearly dunked that for eagle, guys. Good effort. All right. We're two under through three. We're cooking. We're cooking. I got the feeling, though, from the way I'm swinging, I'm going to have some real foobard holes, guys. That is fucked up beyond all recognition. For those of you who've never watched Tango and Cash, or if you use that phrase, I don't know where it comes from. It's from the movie Tango and Cash with Sylvester Stallone. Great film. Get out there and check it out. It's an old film. Show my age. Oh, bloody hell. What's that? 160? 157 could be good here. Little touch of deal off. Little touch of spin. Green is running left to right. So I want to be on this left-hand side. Nah, pushing a fast has gone too far left. One or the other, not both, but it should run right. Oh, it just stays up there. Just stays up there, Alan. Thanks for that. It's one foot downhill, but my ball just stays up there. That should have been a glorious shot. I should have been celebrating. I'm going to put this off the green now. Um, so that's a little bit annoying that that just stayed there. Let's go two square turner and tippy tappy. Yeah. That's a good putt. <laughs> That's a good putt because that a lot of people will put that off the green. Just wanted to make sure I got that up there. Two under through four. Tricky start. And it's been made even more difficult by my lack of any sort of tempo. But hopefully that works itself out as we progress. Because this could be difficult if it doesn't. This is gonna kick left and this could camber into the rough. Please stick. Oh no. Something went wrong there. Something did go wrong, John. Second shot here on the fifth. Heavy rough. This is not what you want to see. We'll try the 160. Slight push, slight fast. It should kick right. It's not going to sit, though, out of that rough. So we could be off the green. It's not a bad effort, guys. We're going to run off the green, I think. Yep. Back in the fairway. Not a bad effort. Let's put full spin on this. This one's your third. As always, when I play these, oh, these major courses, I forget to comment on the course because I'm too busy concentrating on actually trying to play the damn course. <laughs> but Alan, it does look lovely, mate. I love all these little lakes we're playing around. I love it, meandering around them. I'm in a casual so walk around the lakes as I get absolutely irate with my golf. That was a better swing, though. Let's see if we can make the most of this par 5. Uh, I'm not getting up there for toffee. Let's lay back here. Can't reach this one. 
So a long ass par five, certainly in these winds anyway, with a better wind, you might be able to reach that in two, but not for me. Nice. I do not Very have sure. good wind. I think this is a full. I think this is full. I'm gonna trust in myself here. Now I've noticed these feet are taking you way more left than you'd expect of late. And I say that, and these don't, and how has that gone all the way up there and not come back? That was 59 foot up. 59. 19 foot up and 59 yards. So you add six to that, that's 66. How have I gone this far past? And now I got a foot fucking, it didn't come back down this hill either. I mean, that is just, well, a travesty. That was the right shot. I'm standing by that was the right shot. Just for whatever reason, the ball just stuck up here. Oh, come on, game. Okay. What was that? It was like, just went up to the hole, kissed it, and ran away. What the flip? Raging ball. Raging ball. Not good. And we have gone quiet. We have gone very quiet. So, we are two under... Right, we've got to land on the left-hand side of this fairway. I'm not going to go this far because I'm hitting everything fast. So I'm going to deal off this a little bit too. I pushed it and slowed it, but this will run round to the right, but it's going to run long. Didn't slow it enough. It's, it's going to run up, but I need to be a bit shorter than that. Just a little bit, and then we're off the green again. Of course it is. If I can get a chip in. Oh, ref it is, and that's what you want. After a miserable par five, the misery is ended by a delightful chip. And you know I'm playing bad when I'm chipping in, guys. That's what I always say. Matty J does not chip in. When he's chipping in, he's having a fucking bad day. But we're three under through seven. Okay, eighth hole. If we birdie this one, we're averaging a birdie every other hole. And you know what? I will take that. This doesn't seem like a birdie every other whole course. Oh my god, my swing is so bad. It's so bad it's working out okay. That'll do. And that's disappointing. So I want to be playing some good golf around here. I want to give Alan's course the the full shebang. Now I can land short here, guys. A little kick up. So I'm gonna just play this club. Play for this hill and let it just kick onto the hole. And then it should just sit. Should sit, sit. Okay. Oh, that'll do. Good shot. Here Using the go, greens, as Alan back. told me to. Nice All right. Four through eight. I'll take that. That six should have done way better on that. Annoyed with myself on that one. Uh, well, annoyed with the game on that one. Just the phys physics didn't quite work out for me. The maths didn't work out for me. Oh, this is difficult to avoid this. It's difficult to avoid going off the back end of this fairway. I try to take a little bit off that. Try and kick into this hill and hope it slows it up. Hope it slows it up. Yes, it does. Okay, was well judged. Or so to the pin. Now, given how it's gone, I'm going to play this straight up because I gave extra yardage before and we went way long. It feels like a nice shot. Feels like a nice shot. Okay, sit there then. Sit there. Sit there. Don't keep running. Don't, don't, Alan. Don't, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you. <laughs> Alan! Sound like those squirrels. What were those squirrels from? Alan! <laughs> okay, I'm losing the plot. Let's go. Been a long day. Been a tough time in work, guys. So that's why I've been quiet for a couple of weeks. Apologies for that. Um, work has put me and my whole team at risk of redundancy. So I've had to be up in London. I had to score people. I had a lot going on doing my thing, doing my work thing. So I've been distracted, hence there's been no videos, but we're back, baby. Christmas coming up, it's all gonna be good. And we are five under through nine, and we are cooking. Can I get to the double digits, Alan, and challenge me too? The way I've been playing, I would be shocked, but you know, sometimes, sometimes you can polish a turd, my friends. Look at these shots, pushing them left, slowing them, which is straight, straightening them up, <laughs> horrific. This is so bad play, yet somehow I want to end on this left-hand side. So, but I fasten everything. 
Oh no, I've slowed that when I'm pushed that right. <laughs> <laughs> the one I actually tried to push that left and fast that. That's how bad I'm playing, guys. I slowed that and pushed it right. Wow, that is just so bad. It's untrue, but we're gonna chip this in because we're playing so bad. No, we're not. I believe this is for your par. Okay, let's get a par. So far, so good. So far, so good. Oh, and my Christmas outfit, guys. Do you like? It's fucking horrible, isn't it? And I got a bauble. I'm playing with the bauble because I did have the um, the Christmas pudding there. It just looked like shit. Uh, quite literally shit. Right, let's deal off this slightly. We've got to kick it up this hill. This is a well-defended pin. Tricky little par three, Allen, on the 11th. 202 yards, but look at that defended pill. And this is where I have the problem with my clubs, guys, because my longer club, I have a big gap here. So I'm going to have to deal off the 192 and hope it kicks up this hill. And I've snatched at that. I've snatched it. Now he should kick up with a bit of luck. Oh, now just slow down, you beauty, you absolute beauty. I will take those all day, John. I will. And what a course. What a struggle. <laughs> this is going to have people tearing their hair up. Go out there and give it a go, guys. Alan WE54 is his designer name. He's got loads of courses. They're really good. Um, he does like this. Annoying, narrow, bobbly fairways. I'm going to try a little bit of a... Sit, sit, sit. Oh, my God. I am getting so... I am getting... I literally... This is the worst I've swung all week, and I'm getting so lucky. Is this uphill? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. I don't know what I want to do here. I think the 189 gets me there with some D-Loft, guys. I'm going to try and do what I did on the last hole. Kick it up in into the pin. That's a better... Why is that gone so far left? Ooh, can we get a bounce to the right, please? That was a lovely strike. And my swing line was on the right-hand side. And my feet weren't going left. So I'm confused how that ended up over there. That is a little bit disconcerting so we have a 40 foot putt for another birdie in fairness we've had our fair play of luck so finally we hit a shot that we thought was good and it worked out bad <laughs> that just sums up the way i'm playing i thought that was a great shot i thought it was pepper in the pin and it ended up that wide <laughs> <laughs> not playing well but we're six under through trials we are still averaging a birdie every other hole we need to pick one up to get to 10 no oh i'm playing the 160 baby playing it aiming for this to canter it right playing this should just kick to the left from here and at the pin and just run down to it that's a great shot so you play that hole yeah, that'll work. 162 so might have been a bit better club, but that is a great shot, really. I'm happy with that. It did what I wanted it to do. Still a tricky putt, though. Jesus, Alan, you're not letting up with these greens, are you, fella? Turn, turn. Oh, yes. There we go. The flat stick's doing all right for me today. We have two par fives coming up. Can we get to the double Ds? Seven under par at the Double moment. digits, come on. This is what I want. Teeing Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. One. Let's go. Swing is getting better. Tempo's getting better. This We're believing. We're around. starting to believe, people. Yards. 178 is good then. Here. All right, so if my feet ain't go by on the last hole when it just shot left for no reason, this is going to shoot right. So let's go over here. Push is slow. Kind of worked. Not the best shot. Didn't shoot as far right as I was expecting. And that's going to run off down this hill, I feel. It's going to leave me a horrible putt. But we have That'll a putt. For the approach. Here we which go, birdie putt. I will take. Mm. Let's hit this 39. And let's go for it, guys. Let's go for it. Don't know why I started whispering that. I feel like a hush has fallen amongst the crowd. Maddie J steps up. 
He has a feeler. It's off. It's off. Oh, it sneaks. If I left it at the 40, it would have had the legs. Seven under through 14. We need three birdies in four holes. We got a par five. It's a tricky par five. Let's let's do a bit of try and play it into the fairway so it kick oh that is that is drawn way more than I was expecting, but it could work out if it holds there. <laughs> that is lucky. Now, is this going left at my feet? Someone tell me. Because Oh, oh, we got the 222, folks. We have the 222. We have the shot. Can we execute? Oh, it went right at my feet. How's that gone right? Oh, my swing line's a bit off to the right. Sit! Sit! Give me a putt! Give me... Oh, no. I'm never going to get that from there, sadly. Here's our third shot. But we have a chip. We have a chip for eagle. Chip for eagle. Chip. Don't. Ah, oh, didn't have the legs. It just died. And Alan is there uh, and keeping you all on tenterhooks, teasing you all on an eight. Three holes, two birdies is the ask. Matt J steps up to the plate. He swings. This feels good. This feels so good. Oh, this one might oh sit! What? No! How's it gone that long? That felt so good! One, okay. I did not need the deal off. Oh no. We've had an epic, epic fail here. This is going to be awkward as muck. Let's just get it out of there. Nothing I can do there. Just have to fucking swing. Damn it! Well, two holes, two birdies is the ask. And I'm the man. Come on. Let's do this. That was an opportunity on that hole. I blew it. I fluffed my lines. I thought like I hit a really good shot, but no, it wasn't to be. I put too much deal off on, and it took me off the back. Generally thought I was going to dunk that last shot and then celebrate with everybody. Friends, family, thanking the world. Mm. need this to be good this looks good don't go long again this can't be long again no way that goes up there oh that is so annoying oh come on man right, i'm hitting the line I mean, this is this feels like a line that all day i'm gonna trust in alan's design then no that's just stayed out my swing line is staying out right to be fair so there we go guys it ain't going to be double Ds, but I'm taking eight. This feels good. I don't get... Eight and nine seems to be the best I've played on these major courses. I do have a par five, though. I have a par five, folks. Let's whack this up there. My swing line and everything has deserted me. Not been around for the purists. Some people might be watching this thinking, how the fuck does he compete in Patnam? And the answer to that, folks, is I don't compete in Patnam. No. <laughs> This is stupid, but, oh shit, this could be water. Do you know what though, guys? It's time for my J to believe in the glory. You must be feeling lucky. Taking driver off uh -oh. the turf. <laughs> Bounce! Wow! Way! <laughs> wow! Wow indeed, John. Oh shit, I'm in trouble here. We're in a world of trouble here. We've got to reach here. What is this? 34 yards? I think we go long with full backspin. I think we have to go long. Come on then. Come on then, game. Is that all you got? i reach that hill and then somehow stop. I ain't going to stop from there. It's like a foot downhill. Have I just chipped off? Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> uh, come on in. Let's have a chip in to end. Let's go for glory. Oh no! 
<laughs> well, there's all she wrote, guys. Okay, I got greedy there. Could have hit nine under. Well, I went for driver off the deck and absolutely shanked the shit out of it. But there we go. Alan, beautiful course, mate. Eight under. Not playing my best. As I said, I haven't played for two weeks. First time on. Didn't even warm up the old swing. There's the excuses for you. I love an excuse, but beautiful course, Alan. Good luck in the major design competition, mate. Guys, get out there and check his courses out. Alan WE54. And I will catch you all soon for some more course playthroughs and some more shanky ass swings. See you on the team.